Assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I am going to show you how to fix iPhone black screen without losing your data. As you can see here I have an iPhone X, the screen of which is currently black. Actually this phone is currently turned on but nothing shows up on screen. I can hear the notification and charging sound but nothing shows up on the screen. As you can see whenever I plug in the charger I can hear the sound. as you can see but nothing shows up on the screen if you have similar problem with your iphone then in this video i'm going to show you an easy way to fix it without losing your iphone data so with that said let's get started in order to fix your iphone's black screen you need a windows or mac computer in this video i'm using my mac computer this method works the same way on windows computers so you don't have to worry if you have a windows computer after that, you need a software by the name of TenoShare Reiboot. You can get the software from the link given in the video description below. As I said before, the software is also available for Windows users. So just go ahead, download and install the software. Link will be given in the video description below. After installing it, just open it up. Next, click on the start button. The software gives two options to fix your iPhone problem. The first option is standard repair. If you fix your iPhone's problem using this option, it will not erase your iPhone data. And the second option is deep repair. If you fix your iPhone's problem using this option, then it will erase everything from your iPhone. So I'm going to go with the first option because I don't want to lose my iPhone data. After that, click on this blue button. Next up, you have to get your iPhone into recovery mode. This software gives instructions for every iPhone model. So in my case, I am going to go with the first option because my iPhone is iPhone X. All you have to do is get your iPhone into recovery mode by following the instructions provided by the software. So now I am going to put my iPhone into recovery mode. Once you put your iPhone into recovery mode, the next thing you have to do is to download the firmware. In other words, download the latest version of iOS for your device. In my case, this software is suggesting me to download iOS version 50.0. In your case, it might be different depending on when you are performing this method or this trick. You can either download the firmware through the software by clicking on this download button or you can download the firmware through a browser. If you want to download the firmware through browser, just click on this link and it will start downloading automatically. Okay, after downloading firmware, backs up your iPhone data before beginning the repairing process. Once the repairing process is completed, it, re it restores your data. And I think that's what it's doing right now. So it will take another few minutes depending on how much data you have on your iPhone. Okay, after that click on continue. After that your phone will be fixed just like this. As you can see here are the apps that I had on my iPhone. And let's see do I have my contacts. Yes, there are my contacts. And there are my photos. As you can see none of them are touched. So that is how you can fix an iPhone that is on black screen of death. Please let me know what you think about this video in the comment section below. 
and if you have any question also leave it on the comment section below i will try my best to answer your comments if you learned something new from this video then please give it a thumbs up and also share it with your friends and if you want more videos like this in the future then please subscribe my channel with notification on and i will catch you on the next one stay blessed stay safe peace